Madness revving up for the second weekend of the NCAA tournament in basketball. Creighton leaving campus this afternoon, heading to Detroit for their Sweet 16 matchup against Tennessee Friday. Jays not the only ones on the road this weekend. UNO Hockey and Sioux Falls for their opening round game of the NCAA tournament. Lauren Michelson is live on the road with the Mavs. But first, let's start with Matt Satilli, who's live in the Motor City with the Creighton Blue Jays. Matt? Andy, the Jays are here in Detroit. They arrived at the team hotel shortly after 4.30 Central Time. They're coming off the heels of one of the most memorable wins in program history. But make no mistake, they're here for a business trip. They know that it wasn't the most characteristic win against Oregon last weekend. They didn't shoot the ball very well early on. But hey, in March, a win is a win. And as we heard from the team on Monday, all the attention is already on Tennessee Friday night. Just watch some film and move on to the next. I mean, once you've done this for four years, you kind of get good at just enjoying the win for a little bit and then moving on to the next one. I came here to be playing a lot of games in March, and uh, you only get to play more games if you win more games. And so I knew that Creighton was a spot that hopefully I'd be able to help facilitate in that as well. And to be able to win that game was awesome and just looking forward to another great matchup with Tennessee. Because yes, the big news now is this is the third Sweet 16 appearance in the last four years. But the point stands now. Two wins here this weekend, and it would have the Jays in the Final Four for the first time ever. It'll be another late night on Friday night, so rest up now. The Jays and Vols will hit the court here at Little Caesars Arena about 9 p.m. Central Time. They'll hit the practice floor here tomorrow. Reporting in Detroit, Matt Satilli, KETV News Watch 7 Sports. All right.